Hello friends. So this is one of the videos that uh, our user had requested us to get published. So this is a video in which we'll be talking about how you can auto trade using your interactive brokers trading account. So for people who are currently using interactive brokers in the US markets, so you guys would be able to do automated trading on the basis of the strategies that you have. So whatever strategies that you're using, either in the equity segment or in the options or the future segment. So you can translate those strategies into a trading bot or a robot that will automatically catch the signals based on your trading logic and it will automatically execute those signals in your interactive brokers account. So we'll be talking about all of these things in this quick little tutorial. So let me just make you understand that currently we have logged into the Speedbot US platform. And over here, firstly, you need to have a trading bot created that enables you for automated trading in your broker account of interactive brokers. So once you have that, then you can integrate your interactive brokers account. So as you can see in step one, we have all these bots created. So if I click on this particular bot, for example, it is for SPX straddle 945. So this is basically a QQQ and SPX straddle that we have. So I want to go live with it. So in order to go live, I'll have to integrate my interactive brokers account. For that, I can go on to the menu section. I can navigate to the brokers and I can click on add new and I'll navigate for the interactive brokers. <coughs> so over here, you will be able to see two types of interactive brokers. One is live and the other one is the paper. So for users who are already familiar with interactive brokers, so they usually have two sets of accounts. That is one for the live account, wherein the real money is involved. And the other one is the paper account, wherein the in order to paper trade whatever trades you'd like to place. So the paper trade account is provided by interactive brokers under your name. So it is up to you that uh, on the basis of which you'd like to get the execution automated. So for example, if you are going for the paper part, these are the three things that are needed from our end. That is your account ID, your username and your password. So these are basically provided by the IBKR team for you to authenticate it from your side. So over here, while integrating, you would be seeing some of the instructions mentioned. So let us go through each and every instruction. The first instruction or the first step is you need to have a subscription of the market data. Let's say that we were to deploy our bot in the SPX segment that is in the SPX options. So in that case, I need to have the SPX symbol subscribed as per the market data on my interactive brokers account. So this is a must whenever you are automated trading in interactive brokers, right? So this is the first step. So please make sure that you are subscribed to the market data of whatever symbols that you'd like to have the automation on. Next step is whenever you deploy a bot, make sure that you are only logged in to your interactive brokers account on Speedbot, not on any other platform. So this is a bit complex for people who have integrated IBKR on a new basis, right? So just to give you an example, let's say that if I have logged into my IBKR or interactive brokers account on my browser, internet browser, and also I have integrated my credentials over here on Speedbot. In that case, the bot won't be able to catch the execution automatically because it will have two sessions that will it will find 
two logins on different sources or on different platforms. One is on Speedbot and the other one is in your internet browser. So in that case, the bot won't be able to place any trades in your account automatically. So you need to make sure that whenever you are deploying a bot using interactive brokers, you need to log in only through Speedbot. Neither you can get yourself logged in on your internet browser, nor you can log in on your mobile app. So do make sure about it. And every day, whenever the bots are started, interactive brokers will send you an authentication notification on your mobile. So you need to approve that. Once you get it approved, then only the Speedbot would be able to place the trades automatically in your interactive brokers account. Third step is during the active deployment, if by any chance you log in to your interactive brokers account from another source, then in that case, the existing logic won't be running. That is the logic of the bot won't be running in the Speedbot account. So that is totally up to you if you are logging in between when the bot is running. So in that case, the bot won't be able to check further new conditions that were meant to place the trades in the bot that is in your broker account according to the automation. So that won't happen. And do make sure that you deploy the bots before the market starts. So usually the market starts at 9.30 Eastern Standard Time EST. So make sure that you deploy the bot maybe half an hour before the market starts. So that is the ideal deployment time that we recommend on Speedbot. And if you would like to have any dedicated support in this case, so you can contact our team and they'll be able to get you hands on or if you need any help apart from this, so they'll be able to get you the issue resolved. So you can just click on the help button and you'll be able to place the tickets from your side, right? So likewise, you'll be able to find the same for the live session apart from the paper trading account. So the live also consists the same things, right? So this was about how you can use Speedbot for automated trading in your interactive brokers account. So I hope that in this video, you find it uh, pretty informative about how you can do such cool stuff in, as an automated trading in the US markets for your IBKR account. So it was my pleasure sharing this info with you. So thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you in the next one. Thank you so much.